I ask your richest blessings on Michael and Trisha, Lord. Thank you that you have brought family to support and love them and to surround them. And may Michael and Trisha together be about bringing more good into your good creation. together beginning with today work slowly with each other and build a relationship that you both can enjoy being a part of share love and understanding that neither of you are perfect always be reminded of how intensely you have learned to live and how completely you have learned to love grow old together and look back at life and smile surviving three girls one grade apart sharing one car all through high school some WWE Smackdown fights before school in the morning here we are <laughs> you stole the light from the stars above brought it here tonight Trisha you amaze me in the woman you are and the woman I always hope for you to be we love you and we're so happy for you Michael and Leo I'm mesmerized you're unbelievable you're amazing but I've Never felt more alive. Speaking of Leo, this guy has brought all of our families so much closer, and he's the guy who runs the show. I like that. You like it? Hi, Freddy. I'm gonna talk about my new son, Owen Michael. Uh, I realized how much he loved Trisha, and I watched him take on the challenge of becoming a father with strength and grace. Not only Trisha, but our whole family is lucky to have found someone like him that she knows and we all know she can count on to be there for her and love her for the rest of her life. The, the guy's a rock. He's, he's solid and it's been an honor, you know, watching him the last three years as he's grown as a father and as a partner to Trisha. And a lot of how he's grown is contributed to Trisha. I mean, she's, she's raising two men. We are gathered here today for this auspicious occasion to watch Michael and Trisha become husband and wife. The idea of marriage is that someone can look at your marriage and see perhaps a preview of the way Jesus loves the church, the way we all along were supposed to love one another. Clothe yourselves with compassion, kindness, humility, meekness, and patience. And if anyone has complaint against another, forgive each other. Just as the Lord has forgiven you, so you also must forgive. Above all, clothe yourselves with love, which binds everything together in perfect harmony, and let the peace of Christ rule in your hearts, to which indeed you were called in the one body. By the virtue of the authority committed unto me as a minister, the Church of Jesus, I now pronounce you husband and wife. If you may kiss a bud. indeed real in the sense that you spend every waking moment with this person so naturally you always know what they're thinking and you feel what they're feeling and that's why I can stand up here today and tell all of you without a doubt that man right there is the love of my sister's life. When Michael was a toddler he always wanted to run before he could walk. To be honest he always made me kind of nervous but tonight I can finally relax and know that Michael is running towards something very very special. I'm so proud of the man, the father, and the husband that you've become. From here on out, Trisha, you're in charge. Honestly, your love is not only admirable, but a lesson to all of us on true love. I 
just wanted to say a few words for my mom. I'm just so grateful. She deserves all the recognition. So tonight, instead of uh, throwing my bouquet to one of you single ladies, I'm going to dedicate my bouquet to my mom.